Christina and Travis's life together began in middle school. You know, in the ripe age of 14, when, when they met and became instantly best friends. As a matter of fact, Christina told me that at the age of 14, that she understood that Travis was her person. Christina told me that Travis does so many things for her, little things that most people don't notice or can't see. And one of the things she told me that she just loves about him is he saves TikTok videos that he finds funny so he can watch her expression when they watch it together. She says she can count on you for anything and that you are so supportive and that she relies on you and knows that you have her back in everything that she wants to do. She's very appreciative of that and is very proud of the man that you have grown into. You know, when you're talking to Travis, he told me that the one thing that just makes him happy is when y'all are together just walking in the mall or a store, how you'll reach up and just touch his shoulder or pat him on the back. And he said that that genuinely makes him feel happy. He also told me that you're so thoughtful, and that you think of everyone around you, and that you go out of your way to make people feel like they're thought of and cared for. And that is something that he just cherishes about you. He told me that y'all have a little saying, that you'll be together forever and ever without the O, because you'll never be over. I think that is really sweet. Welcome, family and friends. We're gathered here to celebrate one of life's greatest moments, the joining of two hearts in marriage. In this ceremony today, we're gonna to witness the joining of Christina and Travis in marriage. The ceremony is a celebration, and it is a true pleasure to be here. I know it is for me to be part of this special moment, to participate in the wedding of two wonderful people who are so wonderfully suited for one another. The greatest gift known to any of us is love, a love that is given freely and wholly in marriage. So I have to ask, who gives this woman in marriage? I do. In marriage, two people turn to each other in search of a greater fulfillment than either can achieve alone. Marriage is a bold step, it's taken together into an unknown future. It's risking who you are for who you can be together. When two people pledge love, and care for each other in marriage, they create a spirit that is unique to themselves. And even though marriage has been around for thousands of years, every marriage is unique into itself. And it's a promise and a potential that takes a lifetime to achieve. Look at each other's hands while you're holding them. These are the hands of your best friend. They're young and strong and they're full of love for you. They're the hands that are holding you on your wedding day and promise to love you today tomorrow and forever. These hands will give you strength when you need it, support and encouragement to pursue your dreams and comfort through difficult times. And lastly, these hands, even when wrinkled with age, will still be reaching for yours and giving you the same unspoken tenderness with just a touch as they are right now. I, Christina, take you, Travis, to be my best friend forever. I promise that I will honor, love, and respect you through the best and worst of times, I will be there for you faithfully. <laughs> I, Travis, take you, Christina, to be my best friend forever. I promise to honor, love, and respect you. Through the best and worst of times, I will be there for you faithfully. faithfully. <laughs> Christina and Travis will exchange rings to symbolize their commitment. Rings are derived from the humble beginnings of an imperfect metal and they're forged into an unbroken circle, symbolizing their never-ending love. The wearing of the rings is a visible outward sign of your commitment to one another as husband and wife. 
I, Christina, give you Travis, this ring as an eternal symbol of my love and commitment to you. I, Travis, give you Christina this ring as my eternal love and commitment to you. Christina and Travis have professed your love for each other by exchanging vows. You symbolize your commitment in front of your family and friends by exchanging rings. And I only had this to ask of you both. Do you, Christina, take Travis to be your husband, to live together in the covenant of marriage? Yes, finally. Yes. <laughs> and do you, Travis, take Christina to be your wife, to live together in the covenant of marriage? I do. <laughs> The book of Matthew says, So they are no longer two, but one flesh. Therefore, what God has joined together, let no one separate. This commitment is made in love, kept in faith, lived in hope, and eternally made new. By the power vested in me, I now declare you, husband and wife, Travis, and kiss your wife. It is my honor and truly a pleasure to present to you for the first time Mr. and Mrs. Travis and Christina Morton. best sister anyone could ask for. I'm so thrilled that my big sister found her forever love in this life. Christina, you are the kindest and most caring person and you deserve endless happiness and joy in life. Travis, you got lucky. Travis, I do want to thank you for supporting Christina in every way and being someone she can turn to when life gets hard or when she needs love. Not only do you have a remarkable wife, but you have a best friend and a true soulmate. So I'd like to give you both advice. Love can be a shelter, let it. The world is loud and confusing at times, so make a home. And that is a good place where you can always be yourselves and always feel comfortable just being together. No matter how busy your days may be, make time for yourselves. Hold hands. <laughs> Unwind, surprise each other, and find little chances every day to show that you're grateful to be partners, to be friends, to be married. Life is not perfect. You will make mistakes, but each time you will accomplish something together. You will grow wiser, stronger, and surer of yourself. And you will discover even more to love about one another. Make memories that you can laugh and smile about whenever you look back and look forward to. So cheers to the both of you and to everlasting love. I love the both of you guys. I am truly honored to be up here as your best man. I couldn't be happier for you. I do just want to say thank you on the behalf of our family and to everyone that was able to make it out to this occasion. It means the world to us and we are truly grateful for everyone here today. My favorite daily activity when we were kids was when I would hit you by accident or on purpose. <laughs> you would have this need to get me back like no other, so basically the most intense game of tag you've ever seen. You have been with Christina over 11 years now, meaning she already knows what she's getting into with this family. Christina, you really bring the best out of my brother in more ways than one. You are a great balance into our family, and your adventurous soul and kind heart are traits that anyone would want in a partner. Travis, I know we will continue to grow together and through our lives, and I can't wait to experience that. To the both of you, I wish you the best in the next chapter of your lives as you continue to be the biggest fans of each other. And know that you have all of our support in this room at every minute of every day in your relationship. So let's raise a glass to the most important people here, the bar staff. And, and the bride and groom. Yeah.